We had 6100 College Way on a Cadillac. All right, we're we're back with Chaz. Uh, just behind him, in shot there. That's where I got the cartwheel penny from, and we've rolled this log over, which I suppose we could have done when we were here last time, but moved it over, and Chaz has a really nice tone. Yeah, it's it's um it's pretty tight. It's only early this morning, so we're hoping we're starting off with a winner. Let's see what happens. The cartwheel wasn't deep, so maybe I just need to scrape the surface. Scrape the surface and scan it. Yeah, yeah. Ah, it's a oh, coin. It is. <laughs> Look at that. It's a surface coin. It's not a it's not a cartwheel, but it's old. It is old. Jeez, it's light. It's looking like it's going to clean up very easily. It does, doesn't it? Um, I can safely say it's a token. Oh, so this is where Paddy, same area, Paddy found a token. Um, that's awesome. And I, yeah, it's a Draper. We've had this one before, I think. Um, just try and get the name. G, G Ryland Draper Clothier. Market. Um, I don't think I've seen that one. No, but it's uh, just checking if it's Sydney or Melbourne. Yeah, it's actually a little bit different. Awesome. That'll clean up well. Yeah. Can't see what's on the back, but it should be uh, the ship sailing into the distance or something. That actually looks like you got the sun, the rising sun. The rising sun one. Oh wow. Excellent. Nice work. Okay, we're back with Flash, and we're not far from that token. As you do, you hit the area pretty hard. So what do you got, Flash? Yeah, well, second shovel flicked out, and this was on top. And that is a Paris buckle. Wow. Can we get out of my shadow there? And that's the shape of it. I've yeah, never seen one um, like it. I wonder if it'll have the date on there. They usually Probably. do up, up yeah. around the prongs there. Oh yeah, you there. can start to see something coming through. Well, we're definitely, uh, definitely onto something. Well done. Hopefully there's more to come. Excellent. G'day, it's Chaz back. I just called Flash over. Um, we just, this is a spot Flash has been eyeing off for a while and um, we no sooner walked a couple of hundred metres. I actually thought it was a 20 cent piece and um, then I've just seen what looks like Britannia sitting on the back. Looks like a lady in a wheelchair to me. Um, yeah, super excited about this. It's a very early, and um, yeah, we'll probably have a look in the wrap up. That actually doesn't look like a Vicky. Looks like a George. We'll get back to you. All right, it's one of those days. Chaz is jagged. Mid 1800s, mid 1800s, and um, you know, that one that's looking at the turn of the century. And what do I grab? Ten cents. But uh, yeah, on a positive note, because so it's done a little bit of cleaning. Yeah, it turns out it was it was a George, and it's um, 17.99. I'm pretty chuffed. It, it's on par with my my earliest. I've got to break $17.99, but... Right, uh, you've got three from $17.99, I yeah. do. So, I don't want to be greedy, but I'm really stoked. <laughs> nice. Awesome. Tailgate wrap-up. Everyone's favourite. The, uh, the box of trash. Got some good stuff today. And got a mini mag light. Even a... Um, Totem tennis. Um, very, very slim for me. A, uh, a Gia badge, which can go straight into the trash. Internals of a, a pocket knife. Not really quite sure what this thing is. 
my 10 cent and my find of the day, the, uh, the Paris buckle. I can't quite work out what it, it says on the back, but um, yeah, still in pretty good nick. But the finds of the day go to Chaz. Yeah, look, shotgun bases. Um, dollar coin, 20 and a 10, so I'm up a dollar 30. Now this one really is is a flash find. This is the, I think 1852, we had the Draper's token from uh, Victoria. Flash led me to that one. I'll take this one though. Um, again, um, Melbourne, one Forest Street, that's the wine merchant. And then um, this one we filmed, which is the um, 1799 King George the third half penny. Nice. Catch you next time. We had 6100 College Way on the Cadillac. Uh, it's uh, Chaz back. Um, sometimes you dig some iron and you know, you just got to dig it. Found, uh, found this little puppy and I can safely say I ain't going to dig that. I don't know how deep it goes, I don't want to know. <laughs> That's one solid bit of railway line. Cool.